the type of aggressive play that Elevate would bring in the past was a breath of fresh air a number of times. Also, that's formerly Burn All Empires. They've, uh, they've kind of changed things around, done a little merger with the team Elevate from the Silver League, and are kind of looking to grow, and it, it looks like an interesting step for them. You took the game to the next level when you went on an international stage at Rumble in the West. I think Elevate was overly aggressive in this situation. And that is it. Sip is able to take it five to two. I would say a new and improved team. Uh, maybe new and improved, but they're having trouble because yeah. Elevate is sitting here now at zero two. I think that what Elevate's been trying to do strategically is not allow their opponent to ever be comfortable. No. Oh God, and he's already... and Yorick in the 251 is able to just take 100% hit points. Oh my And gosh. down he goes, Fun Gaming will take it, 5-4. Elevate's currently sitting in 12th place in the standings. You had losses against Simp, RBS, uh, Fun Gaming, and Cunninghams. They have shown great promise in some of their plays, tact, just with their tactics and strategy. Victoria's Secret, who had a hell of a series against Elevate, now ready to fall as the remainder of Elevate's push it in. And that's it. Loss gets it. And Elevate closes the tiebreaker series 5-4 to four, straight oh. ahead. And he goes down. Elevate closes the series 5-2 to two against I Love Lamp. Good series between these two teams, but Elevate proved victorious. Elevate will take it 5-1. No way. These guys are so good, man. You know, it is important to, to mention that um, Elevate, they started off very, very rocky. Three losses off the bat, and they've just been crushing ever since then. That shows you just the way they adapt and evolve in this series, in this type of format. Uh, they've been looking a lot better, and uh, I think they're going to do really well.